it was just a bright light that was put out way too soon. It's just wrong. She should not have been taken from us so soon. Police say this woman, 31-year-old Teresa Greenhall, was murdered inside this Tacoma Lincoln District home last week. Investigators also found the body of a roommate, 22-year-old Mary Burris. Teresa's family was in court to see for themselves the man accused of murdering the two women. It just was uh, just shocking. Absolutely shocking. Investigators said the two women had been living in the Tacoma home off and on for some time. And last week, they were inside the house doing drugs with Matthew Leopold and his sister Lindsay and her 15-year-old son. According to court documents, Matthew told detectives he began hearing voices that told him to kill the women. Cops say Matthew then hit them in the head with a hammer and then decapitated them. In the documents, police say Matthew, his sister, and her son came back the next day and tried to destroy evidence by setting the place on fire. And now Matthew is charged with arson and murder. We've charged aggravated murder because there were two victims here. One of the factors that we take into account are the circumstances of the crime, but under the statute, it is the multiple victims that rise this to the level of an aggravated murder. Matthew's sister, Lindsay, has been charged with rendering criminal aid. Her son appeared in juvenile court, but he's yet to be officially charged. The gruesome crime has shattered Greenhall's family, who called her a loving mother to three young children. Yeah, she's a mother, a sister, a daughter.